Hello and welcome to Betting Expert. In this video, I'm going to present our top 10 tips to help you become better at betting on football. Now, all of the information here is taken from the Betting Expert Academy, which you can enroll in for free. But let's get straight into it with our tip number one. And that is to only bet when you see value in the market. Now, I've, we've done other videos on how to actually identify value bets and what they are. But essentially, if you can bet on an outcome that you predict is more likely to happen than what the bookmakers odds suggest, then you're going to profit more in the long run. Now, tip number two to bet better on football is to always be prepared to learn more. Now, you might be an expert on the Premier League and all the stats behind it, so that you might know how often Jose Mourinho's sides keep clean sheets against the top six in the table, or how many minutes it takes for Sergio Aguero on average to score a goal. But if you don't know the nuances and the intricacies of betting markets, then you might struggle to profit from the long run. So be humble and don't be afraid to learn new things if you want to profit more on your football bets. So tip number three is to stick with the league that you know most about. So for instance, if you were a Premier League expert, it doesn't make much sense to switch over to the Danish second division and bet on a team there. If for instance, there's a break in the Premier League action, that's probably not the best strategy moving forward. So always stick with what you know. And that leads us nicely into tip four, which is to stick with the markets you know most about as well. So you might be an expert on the 1x2 market or Asian handicaps. It doesn't make much sense to then look at last goal scorer markets or 10 minute throw in lines or something like that if you have an edge in those particular markets. So tip number five is to apply sound money management. So this is something that we do talk about a lot here on Betting Expert and in the Betting Expert Academy. Responsible gambling and being sensible with your bankroll is key to be able to profit long term. And tip number six is to keep a record of every single bet you place. So this is actually going to help you keep a more sound bankroll management strategy because you'll have a record of every single bet you place. But you can also learn new things as well. So you can identify trends in your winning bets or potentially spot mistakes so you don't repeat them in the long term as long as you're keeping a consistent record of your bets. Now it just so happens we're going to help you out with this as well with a free spreadsheet you can download from the Betting Expert Academy. The link is below the video. Tip number seven is to assess performance potential accurately. So you'll hear a lot about the form of a team, whether or not they've won their last couple of matches might be seen as a good thing. But when it comes to football betting, you're going to need to look beyond that to assess the performance potential accurately. So things like, are there any injuries in the squad or their suspensions as well? Those could play a factor if key players are missing or even the replacements that come in to replace those players. If they're not firing, that can really hamper your team's chances of winning. There are other factors as well to look at, such as fixture congestion. So if it's like over the Christmas period in the Premier League where there are lots of fixtures one after the other, that can play a big role and have a big impact on whether or not a team will perform at their best. Other things as well, like the style clash. So whether there is a team like Leicester were when they won the Premier League, very much a counter-attacking side. But if they come up against a team that really does play well against the counter-attack, they have quick defenders, they can stop that in its tracks, then that's another really important factor to take note of. Now, tip number eight is to exploit biases in the market by betting against the crowd. Now, what I mean by this is once you've identified a value bet, it's really a good idea to commit to that regardless of what the market is suggesting. So an example of this is that most casual punters will actually look at potentially short priced home favorites to win, where you might have identified value in the away win. So actually you're increasing your value in that case by avoiding what the crowds are doing by looking at those short price favorites. Now tip number nine is to follow some football tips that experts. So it just so happens here on Betting Expert, we do have a pool of profitable tipsters that are experts when it comes to football betting. Now you might have looked around online and noticed there are other tipsters out there that potentially charge for their tips as well, or every tip on Betting Expert is free. 
but also with those other tipsters that do charge their tips, you might not have a reliable track record of their profit and loss. Whereas on Betting Expert, well, our tipsters are competing for cash prizes based on whether or not their tips are successful. So we do keep a record of every single tip posted to the website. And as I said before, it's completely free for you to go and read them and follow the advice. And our last tip, tip number 10 to bet better on football is to have multiple betting accounts. Now this makes a lot of sense when you are looking at those value bets and basically making the most of the odds out there. So a website like SmartBets will help you compare the odds of a range of different bookmakers. And as long as you've got accounts at each one, then you'll be able to use the best odds possible on your value bets. So that's it, there are top 10 tips for betting smarter on football. Thanks a lot for watching, I'll be back soon with more videos, but for now, always gamble responsibly.